I really appreciate your offer. It would just break my heart for how much I put into it, and for those reasons, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Hello Sharks, my name is Hans Dos. I'm from Dana Point, California, and I'm here seeking $200,000 in exchange for 10% of my company, Tentacle. As you can see, I love the ocean. I especially love the octopus. With all these tentacles, they could do so many things at once. <laughs> we humans have a big problem. Holding phones while trying to do something else with only two hands. You'll never see an octopus with not enough hands to snap a selfie. <laughs> Currently, these options for humans oh my. Oh, 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 only serve a single function. What if we had one portable product that did everything these do? Now we do. Introducing Tentacle, the octopus-inspired suction mount for your tech designed to empower go-getters to do their thing better, totally hands-free. Tentacle does a million things. It works with phones, cameras, tablets. It's your car mount, your bike mount your speaker mount, and hold your seahorses, even <laughs> a pickle holder. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> and just like the octopus, Tentacle is waterproof and super durable. It can even support the weight of a surfboard. Wow. Humans only have two hands. Let's fix that. <laughs> so sharks, what do you say you jump in with a fellow sea creature like me and make a huge splash in the boring mount industry? I like it. I really, really like it. Thank you. I think you need a reboot. So I'm, I'm going to make you an offer. You owe total debt $270,000, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. I will give you $270,000. We pay off the existing debt to everyone. OK. And basically, that brings the company back to ground zero. Yep. I will then give you an additional 100000 to seed the new company. Here's the catch, though. I own 60. You own 40. No. Here's the caveat, Yowza. though. Here, here's the caveat. Yay. You're going to have to bring in real partners who are going to run the business. Bad idea. The next Ooh. partner we bring in is another Hans who has the level experience, has the experience in this area, and whatever equity we need to give them, it'll come out of my 60%. Well, that's interesting. All right, Hans, let me, you know, let me tell you why I think yeah. my fellow sharks are tucking and rolling out of this deal, because of your vulnerability mm -hmm. to say you only have $39, right? And a lot of people come on here and they, they act like everything's all great, so I say, well, yeah. why are you here? But on the flip side, I get it. You know, when I had turned my mother's house into a factory, I took $100,000 loan. It was the biggest and the largest amount of pressure I ever had in my life. Yeah. Three months later, I turned around and I only had $500 in the bank. I was three months later on the mortgage, right? I was paying for raw goods 90 days ahead of time. I was paying for a staff and salaries and my accounts receivables. They wouldn't pay me for 30, 60, 90 days. Yeah. And it was this moment in my life where my mother came home and said, I'm gonna take an ad out in the newspaper. I said, that's the stupidest thing I ever heard. She took out an ad. Million dollars in orders need financing. I got 33 offers the next day. Wow. 30 of them were loan sharks and people like yeah. Kevin O'Leary. You're lucky I was there for you, Damon. I had nothing, zero. Yeah. I believe in you, but it's gonna be expensive because this is such high risk. Yeah. But I'm gonna offer you the $200,000 for one third. One third. 33, 33 and a third. Percent. Okay. 33 percent. And no, 33 and a third. Let's make it. Let's make it an even 30. I know you know my back's up against the wall, but that's not the. Well, purpose. at least you were honest about it. I'm not why. trying to put your back's up against the wall, but I'm putting money risk. at risk. Yeah, I'm, I understand. Okay. Um, and actually, that's not a bad offer, all things considered. It's better yep. than I would have done. I'm out. Okay. Thank you, Mark. You have an offer from Robert, and you have an offer from Damon. Damon's offer is legit. Well, my offer is legit, Mark. No, it isn't, Robert. Robert, it is a legitimate offer, and I really appreciate your offer. It would just break my heart for how much I put into it, and for those reasons, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been always wanting yeah. to say that? No, I've been wanting to say that forever. <laughs> you had to give it on. You had to do it. You had to give it on. Honestly, <laughs> all right, well, listen, Damon. I'm... 
This is a moment right here, dude. We're good. It is. Yeah, dude. I like this. Dana, what would you feel about 25% for the 200K? I feel 30 sounds really good. I know it sounds tasty, but really, that's 25 You came down 30. from 33 and a third. Yeah, remember, I went to 33, I, I went back I to 30. I know you did, yeah. Dude, I think we could do a killing together. I think you can open up a ton of doors, and I can execute. I know I can execute. What's your best counter? 25% is my best counter offer. I, I, I love it. I think I will take it at 30. <laughs> <laughs> That's hard, man. Uh, let's do it. Yeah. Yeah. I like the counter. All right. The golden ticket goes to my favorite product. I've made you a good offer. That's what I'm talking about. That is the winner. Riding all the way to the bank, baby. Yeah. You've come to the right place.